Kufa Energy extracts the natural gas for our Athena gas plant from our casino, Henry and Netherby fields, which sit offshore in the Otway Basin. The underwater gas pipeline comes ashore at the mainline valve station on the Great Ocean Road west of Port Campbell and continues to flow via a four kilometre underground pipeline to the gas plant. The gas arrives into the plant at the slug catcher where bulk liquids such as hydrocarbon condensate, glycol and water are separated. The gas then flows to the raw gas compressor where it is boosted in pressure before being cooled to around minus 20 degrees Celsius by the dew point control unit to remove liquids and bring it into pipeline specification. Finally, the gas is compressed, metered and odorised prior to being distributed through the sea gas pipelines, which transport the gas west into the Pelican Point power station to help power Adelaide and east, delivering it into the East Coast gas network. The liquids that were separated out in the slug catcher are then sent to the medium pressure separator for further separation. Hydrocarbon liquids are treated to allow transport to the Viva refinery in Geelong. Aqueous liquids, such as monoethylene glycol, are treated to allow reuse. The flare is in place for emergencies to ensure that all gas is safely removed from the plant. The surround is purely in place to minimise the visual impact of any flaring. The offshore gas fields and gas plant are all controlled and monitored by a distributed control system. If the system detects excursions from expected operating parameters, it will automatically shut down the offshore fields and plant. The upgrade and recommissioning of the Athena gas plant has established Cooper Energy as a midstream operator of critical gas processing infrastructure. Athena will be processing gas from the Otway Basin and supplying the domestic market for many years to come.